Good morning. Got some fun things going on today. Uh, we are meeting up with a group of people that are shooting the documentary. They're actually coming to the house here in just a little bit. Yesterday, although I didn't show this on the blog, I went to the Automobile Driving Museum and picked up a 1956 Plymouth Belvedere. It's red, it's gorgeous, and the focus of this documentary is on Pacific Coast Highway. Whether it's focused in Malibu or all PCH, I'm not really sure. But it's gonna take about uh, an hour for them to set up the cameras and mount them on the car and things like that, and then we're gonna go for a drive, and I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. So it's a day of filmmaking. Cleaning up for these guys are about to come over, but uh, while I was cleaning up downstairs and taking some trash out, I found I'm not really sure how you describe this. I, I found a mole head, you know, a little mole, and but just his head. Not not really sure how that happened, but. There's nothing more fun than being involved in film production. When you're part of a group that is making something creative, uh, and case in point, a documentary like this, it's really cool to see all the pieces come together and then eventually there'll be a finished film. Now these guys seem to know what they're doing, so chances are it's gonna be cool. And when you're driving a cool car like this 56 Plymouth, how can it be bad? What, what's the biggest challenge in mounting uh, one of these cameras for you? Um, biggest challenge is to make sure the car is always safe because the, we're just using metal parts. Yeah. But your car is way more precious than anything we're bringing. <laughs> so that's the biggest challenge. Usually it's the other way around. People are concerned with the car. Uh, yeah. You well, know. Well, it's making sure that all of our suction points are uh, grappling and they're not like they're not suctioning on a curve or on a lip. Yeah. Or, or it's yeah. Not having I'm, I'm always concerned with the cameras. Yeah, well, <laughs> you know, we, we've got these little straps, uh, straps here, so we'll then, after we mount it on the mount, we'll then ratchet strap it so that it is more secure. Nice, all right. So, We're sitting here getting ready to go. This is Daniel, the director and the writer for this documentary. What are we doing exactly? We are making a documentary about PCH, mm -hmm. Pacific Coast Highway, here at, specifically as it cuts through Malibu. I'm working with a man named Michelle Shane, mm -hmm. whose daughter Emily was killed uh, at the corner of PCH and Heathercliff, just a couple miles up the road. Right. And uh, this is a very dangerous place to drive. And I'm kind of a newcomer to California and uh, meeting Michelle Shane. Philly guy right here. Philly, yeah. Yep. And hearing Emily's story yep. and how much she meant to the community of Malibu too. Uh, we realized that there's a story to tell here about the dangers of PCH, right. how Malibu came to be, and Emily's story as well. So it's a combination of what, what it's like to live on PCH and all the, all the factors, but also an historical account. Absolutely, we're picking right up with Mae Ringe, all the right. woman who owned all of Malibu at one point, and awesome. they built the PCH right through her right. built PCH right through her land. Yeah. Yep. So we're going to be taking this Plymouth, this '56 Plymouth, and we're going to be driving up the coast. Absolutely. Yeah. We got the camera mount going here. I know. It's the real deal. Uh, and you're going to be asking me a bunch of questions about PCH. Yeah, I want to hear about your experience as a seasoned driver here in PCH, somebody who also has a lot of respect for cars oh, yeah. and the power that they have, yeah. uh, and also pedestrian responsibility here too is very important. Awesome. Well, we're going to have a good time. Cool. and we're leaving. Everything seems to be in place. Seafood right now, all the seafood. These guys are checking the mount on the car. Everything is looking good so far. Not too bad. I'm just trying to make sure our camera is not gonna mess up this car. <laughs> I'm trying to make the car doesn't mess up the camera. <laughs> How's the sound? All right, uh, I'm gonna go in and grab a bottle of water little bite of something. Yeah. On mounting uh, K2 
camera's in a different direction on the car, so I just walked across the street, the county line. It's a pretty nice day today. Take seven, marker. Couldn't be happier. Is everybody doing their job? This guy over here with the camera, he's, he's rocking. Yeah, James is always ready. James is ready to hang out the window to, with his camera. And Whatever it takes to get the shot. Good job, guys. So. Rockin' pros. <laughs> all right, we're all done filming. I'm gonna walk down to uh, the burger joint at the bottom of the hill, grab myself something to eat, while those guys uh, take all the cameras off of the car. We got a little bit more uh, voiceover stuff to do inside the house. That should be it. finished with these guys they're right back there we've been shooting at the house a little bit hopefully we're done soon look at that steering wheel that is cool voila that was a, a really really cool experience big thanks to daniel and his team of incredible filmmakers who came out to the house we pretty much shot most of the day so we, we got a lot of stuff we actually went back up pch and shot a bunch of driving things uh, the camera was mounted to the the van that they were driving their chase vehicle, and then they were shooting the car driving. Daniel's cameraman was hanging out the side of the car. You know, it's the typical thing that you see, uh, you know, as you're driving up PCH and people are making movies and different kinds of stuff. But there's nothing more exciting for me than to be in the process of filmmaking. That's why I do these vlogs. That's why I've done a lot of the films that I've done. Show up on set, there's all kinds of really cool energy. Everybody's doing their job, getting their stuff done. And if it's got a really good director, then uh, everyone kind of pools their efforts and, uh, and they create something really cool. I'm grateful to be a part of it, and I think it's really going to be a good film because it also has a great message all about Emily, and uh, if you're not sure uh, exactly what happened with Emily, I'll, I'll let you guys look it up. Her name is Emily Shane. A very difficult thing, uh, what happened to Emily, but her parents have done a really great job at using her name uh, to, to create great awareness for what happens here on PCH. You guys have been watching the vlog. You know the stuff that happens on the street. It's a, a free-for-all. There's all kinds of things that happen, so it's important. If you do come out to, to Malibu and you are driving, uh, take responsibility for for the vehicle that you have and the, and the way you act and you'll have a great time. But if you act like an idiot, you're gonna suffer the consequences. That's just going without saying. I'm looking forward to the movie. When it's finished, it's gonna be awesome. Uh, and uh, thanks for watching. And I've stated it a thousand times, I'm gonna state it again. Our job here on the vlog is to help you improve your life through what you love. We do that on a daily basis. We're well over 630 episodes. And if you've been watching, you know things get a little wacky around here. But I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.